A very warm welcome to all of you mga ka-orange and for those that are new to my channel, thank you agad for your time visiting my YouTube channel. Well, for today's video, I want to share with you the five mottos or quotations that I always keep in mind and these things surely help me to get where I am now. I know, I know, every situation is different, but who knows, this might help you too to stay on the right track until you reach your goals. Well, no more long messages and whatnot, chop, 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 right on, yo! Motto number one, don't stop until you are proud. If you come to think of it, this is really simple, but with its simplicity, there's a deeper meaning in it. If you don't feel the satisfaction with what you're working on, don't ever expose it yet. Silently work on your self-improvement and your next move. If you already felt the sense of fulfillment, I guess it is the right time to tell the great news to your family and friends. Just don't brag too, too much about it. Stay humble. Keep your feet on the ground. Well, Let's move on to motto number two. Losers got nothing to lose. Yup, you heard it right. It sounds negative. Yes, yes, I know. But you know what? It really actually helped me to take more risks. The more I tell to myself that I'm a loser, the more I gain my confidence to put myself in a difficult situation. Something that is out of my comfort zone. Because hey, you are already a loser, and if this thing went bad, you got nothing to lose anyway. Well, so, take your chance and go for it. You will be surprised if you succeed. At least, I am not a loser now. But of course, don't really look at yourself as someone who is incapable of doing something. The main reason why I always keep this saying in mind, it's because... It drives me to take every opportunity that is given to me. That's all. Just trick yourself from time to time. Moving on. Number three is keep moving forward by Walt Disney. Moving forward means opening up new doors, opportunities, and experiences. I know there will always be challenges and struggles along the way. But we don't stop and park our cars from there. We just pause, take a break, and then move on. Ride along. I believe that every situation has an explanation or reason. There is a reason why you walk up late. Or a reason why your boyfriend or girl girlfriend dumped you. And our job is to figure out the reason behind all these happenings. There is always a lesson that we can learn from every trial or difficulty in life. We just have to be mindful. So keep moving forward. We don't come this far just to get or come this far. By Jeffrey R. Holland. Fourth motto, keep a positive perspective. Some of you are just watching this to look for my errors or shortcomings. Yep, yes, you heard me. Not all my viewers really like what I'm doing. But hey, it's okay. At least they are helping me gather watch hours, right? That's a positive perspective. What I mean is, I can't please everybody and so do you. There will always be criticisms, feedbacks, which could hurt your feelings or ego, but keep a positive perspective. Take it as an opportunity to be better, to be the best version of yourself. Don't take it seriously because at the end of the day, you are what you are. You know yourself more than anyone, so keep that prudence in you, yo. Welcome every feedback and criticism. Last but not least, are you ready? 
Well, it's actually a Bible verse from the Old Testament. And it is Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 to 6. Oh no, you knew this scripture, Mastery? Sweet! Okay, let's recite. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 to 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. Yeah, you are awesome. So I bring this with me. Always, I love this verse since 2007. It just simply gives me an assurance that the Lord is always by my side. That I should trust His plans for me and never rely on my own or to others. Just be mindful of some personal revelations from God and He will surely lead us to the path that we exactly need to be. Y'all, these are the five quotations that I always keep in mind. Well, let's have a quick recap, shall we? Number one, don't stop until you're proud. Number two, losers got nothing to lose. Number three, keep moving forward. Fourth, keep a positive perspective. And last, Proverbs chapter 3 verses 5 and 6. I hope this video helps you even a little to be on track. If you find this helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And of course, you have my permission to share this video to all the people out there. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell so you will be notified for another awesome video. Thank you mga ka orange See you again on my next vlog! God bless y'all! Shout out to all my consistent viewers out there and please wait for the shout out video the next time that I provide another vlog, okay? And please keep in mind that God loves you, that He has plans for you. So always, always, always remember that and I hope you also find my video today very nice because this is my uh, Saturday routine. So I always do my laundry, I always uh, exercise every day, I always do my laundry every Saturday, by the way, and uh, what else? I always do the general cleaning every Saturday. So without anything to say, thank you so much again for watching and take care you all. God bless you. See you next time!